Right, well, hello the internet, it's Ghost here, and welcome to another, ep ugh, another episode of Minecraft Creative. There we go, I need to slow down on my words. It's episode two, which is pretty cool, I like the number two. So we're going to start off by talking about why number two is a good number, and there is only one reason, and that is it's the only even prime number. Therefore, in my opinion, it's a good number. Moving on swiftly, we're building a bakery today. Um... We built a bakery a little over a year ago, and I feel like we've probably done another one since, but I don't remember when or where. Therefore, it is justified for me to build another bakery again, because we're going to effectively get to a point of cycling the same build, because there is only so much you can do. Why do I just keep staring into nothingness on Minecraft? There we go. Problem solved. Um, If I find any more of that footage, it's not getting cut. You'll have to put up with the screen being still for a while. This is my third take where I come across the footage because apparently I don't think to look at back at it. Um, so yeah, today's build is a bakery that is going to be built out of cherry planks. There is some birch in there in two forms actually. Well done me, we're being diverse with our block choices. <laughs> oh, there's a bee that keeps trying to get involved with the build and there's prismarine. Um, I find that every time I build something with prismarine and I think the most recent thing besides the um debut section of the taylor swift town it's not a village anymore it is literally a town it is massive um was probably for the aquarium i think that's the last time i used prismarine properly it always just freaks me out a little because it has like the shifty colors and i can't get my head around it it genuinely <laughs> freaks me out um I don't know why it just kind of stays the same colour for a while and then all of a sudden, ooh, there's multiple blocks, we'll start doing fancy shifty colours. And the bee, the bee's still trying to get involved, but we love that bee. What are we going to call the bee? Bert? Ben? What are we calling it? Um, we're going to call the bee Ben, I think. <laughs> and then go back to the interior of the cafe slash bakery kind of thing. I put down... Um, what is that? A counter. There's a counter. Honestly, right now, words are just not wording. So we're just kind of working them out fairly carefully. I don't know what I'm saying. I keep getting distracted by my phone, so I've just switched it off. Um. Anyway, now that my words are not going to be distracted by my phone, <laughs> I then built the stuff into the kitchen, which is fairly standard. I use barrels a lot over chests. Actually, I don't remember the last time I placed a chest in Minecraft. Um, mostly because I can stack them and I think they look nicer than chests. They have, don't, they have like the same amount of storage space. And I mean, obviously sometimes you're going to need a double chest because you're going to have loads of one thing. But this is creative Minecraft. It's fine. We can get away with it. Um, I did a little bit of detailing to the roof. Is that really detailing? I'm kind of just like making it not look really chunky and gross. Then I added some lanterns to the ceiling. Uh, probably added some more light blocks at some point. And then I made chairs. What did I use for my chairs? Oh no, I did windows and a door. And I couldn't decide whether or not I wanted to use a cherry door, but I didn't even like test it. And then I added a sign that said the bakery because I love the hanging signs and I don't use them anywhere near enough in Minecraft. I added a little like booth seat in the corner and then I think I ended up changing it because I didn't like it. Oh no, I didn't get rid of it. Wow, well done me. Um, added a couple of additional tables. And then added flowers. I'm trying to do it on this build that to kind of blend builds that are like very contrasting colour palettes together. Um, hence the... Well, uh, we're getting to this. Okay, so next to this build is obviously the train station, which was episode zero. A.K.A. the debut episode of season two, which we're on now. And I started placing flowers down and hadn't actually decided what the block palette for the next build was going to be. So what are we going to do? We're going to use the flowers to blend the builds together so that they look cohesive. And then I don't have to do something fancy and put hedges and trees next to it. And I added moss because I went through a phase of every build had moss near it somewhere. And then I just stopped. And I don't think it was because we got a new update. It's because I didn't really terraform a lot of the stuff around my builds until like <laughs> several months later. And I still need to go through and like actually terraform stuff for the town that um, was built 
over the course of the last year, I think it was. And this town's going to be done before the end of the year. I'm pretty sure based off of how much space we have. And I'm going to try and do bits on different elevations for once. I mean, there is some elevation varying but it's not significant on the other town so we're gonna work on that but anyways the internet i will see you all again on sunday i hope you have a good day and goodbye